Hold on to your capes, digital dynamos. Our next mission, mastering app control. On your kiddos, iPad or iPhone. Worried about the apps they are downloading? Well, watch this and you will have complete control. And remember, if you missed the previous video, click the link in the corner. We are now gonna look at how you can get your children to request apps from the App Store. Now on the parent iPad, or you can do this on the child iPad if you go into screen time and put the passcode in. I'm gonna do this on the parent iPad, so we're gonna go into settings, and then we're gonna go into screen time, scroll down to your child, and then what we're going to look at is content and privacy restrictions. Now we've got this on at the moment, so if we was to turn this off, it's gonna ask for the passcode. Then what will happen on the child's iPad, the app store will appear as you can see on the screen here. What we can do is now go into the App Store on the child's iPad and then the child can actually go and request an app. So let's take a look at one of these apps. Let's have a look at and let's choose Google Chrome. So we're going to get the Google Chrome app. Then we can install it. We need to put the password in for that particular Apple ID. And then a message will pop up asking the child to ask permission to get that app. So we're going to ask now and then go back to the parent iPad. You can see there, there is a request. So we're gonna tap on that request. If you miss the notification request, then you can go to the notification center by swiping down from the top of the iPad to see the notifications. And that request is indicating that the child would like to get an app. As a parent, we can either decline it or get it. So I'm going to get that app. I will need to put in the password for the Apple ID for the parents. Incidentally, if you've got Face ID or Fingerprint ID, this may be done automatically. On the child's device, they will get a notification to say it's been approved. If you miss the notification, you can go into Notification Center. You can see the request has been approved and then now that app will now be installed. You can see that app being installed right now. Once that app has been installed, what I suggest, you go back to your content and privacy restrictions in screen time and turn that back on. You will need to enter your screen time passcode and you will notice then that the app store will disappear on the child's iPad. So that is how you can get your child to request different apps from the App Store and then get permission to install them. So you want to know more? Why don't you click on one of the videos here and find out more about family sharing and screen time. Oh, and don't forget, if you like this, then subscribe and like my videos.